Welcome back, guys, to Pokemon Legends Arceus. Well, last episode, after returning to Jubilee Village to receive our seven-star promotion, we decided to focus on completing more requests rather than report our noble quelling, securing even more wares for the general store before evolving a matchup and heading back out to the Crimson Myland. There, we battle with a Pachirisu against an Ursuline to complete another request, who are finding coin awaiting for a random battle, and after then attending a Chimcha outbreak, now have come to the Coronet Highlands to search for the sister who keeps getting lost. Oh, she's just over there. This quest has ended up easier than expected, hasn't it? I mean, so. There she is. Oh, it's Andrea! At last! Oh, I knew you'd come find me. I got even a gust from Honchcrow that sent me tumbling down right down the mountainside. I couldn't climb back up and I couldn't get down either, so I've been stuck. So, um, please get me back on track. I mean, all you have to do is climb there and you can see a camp. You're always around to save me when I need it. If only you were in my core, <laughs> Alessandria, I'd be so much better off. We're galaxy teammates. Really? It's such a relief to hear you say that. I'm so glad I can rely on you, Alessandria. It was a little embarrassing, I guess, to admit to myself that I need to rely on you. Oh, you know what? I used to think the Sneezer was a mean Pokemon, so it looks sly and unsavory, but it helped me out of a real tight spot, so I guess it must be good at heart after all. Another quest complete. Where am I currently? Say, I've been moved quite a bit, haven't I? Yeah. Where am I? Over here. That was close. Okay. Well, I guess fun one thing we can do while we're here. I'm going to hit that tree at the very least. Let's explore the remaining areas that we haven't explored. Because <laughs> this will be the moment a charm comes out. How many go about a uh, free? I was wondering how many you could get in battle at once. I don't know, is charm only for that area? I'm imagining not. <laughs> That's an alpha. It's fine, I can get away with him in the blink of an eye. Would you like a chair if I've got an extra? Well, I need the whole Pokedex, so I need like multiple cherim, don't I? This is the only way I can go about doing things. So I not only need lots of cherubs, I need them in bulk. <laughs> so I actually do need to do the catching. That's the real problem. I think that's my goal for the remaining period of time we're playing in this session. Which isn't all that long left. I wish to see one chair, please. But somehow it's never going to be true. <laughs> I'm too far away from the battle. Oh, that would been horrible if it was a cherub. <gasps> Just imagine. So wait, this area has been... This area is unexplored? I haven't been here before. Huh? 
supposedly, anyway. Have a lot of skin tanks around here, that's for sure. So yeah, it's just like this area over here. Which is that way, currently. Which I'm trying to work my way towards. My life for an alpha sneasel at this point. Okay, so yeah, we gotta climb that mountain to get to a new location. I just saw a fast magic cup. It's always you, where madam. Thanks for the. Uh, Ten leper berries. It was interesting how that interacts with the terrain a little bit. Okay. That being a whisper right there is nice. But I do out here too. So this is unexplorable that way. This is just above that bit we went to where the scun tanks were. Which just seems to be Gollum the one that leads down to this area with the Badu in the valley. Not an alpha badu, I take it. And into this lake. That hurt. Now that's different. Masculines. They didn't stick around for me to catch them, though. They very much got out of Dodge as soon as I went in the water. That's kind of irritating. Zelia. Nothing really too much over here. Austin, thank you for the follow. Nor over here. Again, this area might be a lot better during the night. But during the day, it seems pretty empty. So exploring down here... Didn't really provide results. That's how I put it. Nothing really of note for exploring the Fabled Spring. But if it's called the Fabled Spring, there's got to be something good there in the future. Right, so that is the entirety of their explored. The only place we haven't explored all of now is the Cobalt Coastlands, believe it or not. And you know what? I might already have an elegant tale done. I've only seen one or, or two octillery... Well, octillery in a rift, octillery alpha. The macho... Surely that's complete by now. Got a show boss with the complete, so that's got to go to Cobalt Coast then for that. 
I Pom Heal is also a Cobalt Coastlands. A Streepus I haven't seen. So let's go for that. Work our way out of this area. Go with the Cobalt Coastlands. That will work for me. More Wormadums. Let me see Leap Out Trees is now going up. Next criteria for that is 10. The fact I haven't actually completed that one is kind of crazy. We can catch a combi at Ipom Hill. We can catch... We can go give in the macho thing, which should be done. He says... So I was about to say everything's nearer to the beach side, but really we can kind of take a warp to Ipom Hill. I thought we could. I thought we could warp to his camp, but it seems we can't. The rain's coming in. Don't know if and what Pokemon that will really change. Didn't change these guys in the center, did it? Not in the slightest. Still got an Alpha Macho there. I must have done this by now. How have I not completed the Pokedex entry for Machoke? I'm so surprised by that. Oh, this guy really doesn't look the other way, does he? Number caught six out of ten. It's got to be some battle metrics I need to go for then. I really, really thought I was there. Maybe if I just evolved some guys, some matchups that I've got. They must be around the right level, right? Maybe that would bolt me over to the, night, the right amount. That fell ever so slightly short. <laughs> Look, it's not a cherim. Eyes on the prize. The other quest we came here for is you. To be honest, I could just, just ultra ball you in the face. Now we'll catch you. Okay, combi caught on Ipom Hill. We can at least hand in that one. There's a new request. Another new request. A balloon race! How did I miss this? 
Hello there, is this your first crack of the Blue Race? Or maybe you've had to go before? Either way, why not team up with Pokemon and try out my fun balloon bursting game? You should burst as many of my adorable balloons as possible while riding a Pokemon. It's exhilarating, really. If you managed to burst, say, 24 balloons well, that'd be an impressive start. You can find me here anytime, so let me know whenever you feel like testing your skill in the balloon race. That's request 47. Is it a water one, then? I guess it would be... Oh, I feel like this track might be a switch track. 40 balloons, 1 minute 20 seconds. It's a switch track. Am I going to have to double jump some stuff here? Oh, I didn't really, really mean to do that one. That's the... Uh, Inappropriately placed Alpha Gyarados, I'll have you know. Okay, I've already reached the uh, the right amount, yeah. I could just run over this one. That'd probably be a little faster for it. Find my jump. Tentacle rule. Ha <laughs> ha. What a devilish position. Oh, I'm going to be so close. <laughs> wow, okay. That's going to be really close. <laughs> I can burst 40. Two bags of Stardust, is that all? I can get them all cheap. Oh, a nugget. 10,000. 10 Ultra Balls too, that's pretty good. Now I can get them all chief. I believe. I believe. Three, two, one. Go on, go. Send me out. I'm wondering, actually, is the double jump faster inherently? Does it give you a second boost of speed? A bit forward momentum, I'm not sure. If it's slowing me down. I'm not sure I'd appreciate it, you know? <laughs> Gotta cover some angles for that, haven't you? Perfection. You burst 40 balloons! P perfection I said that! <laughs> you popped every single balloon! You're definitely a balloon bursting boss, that's for sure. And that means you deserve something special to mark the occasion. Two nuggets, 20k! A seed of mastery too. I'll take some more ultra balls. Well, I just made 30,000 off the balloon races, so that was a great one. I enjoyed that. Money, 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 money. Money. Thank you very much, sir. Uh, I guess, Lavington, unless you have my match oak filled up, which I'm pretty sure isn't going to be the case. <laughs> which is very upsetting. I want match oak to level 10. 
I only got matchup up. I think most of it just is see their moves, most likely. Damn it. I want it. I want to get done. Well, at least we did get the combi. We got the bloom popping them. That's, I say that's another request off the list, but it's not. It was a request we found and then instantly completed. That's not quite the same thing. Which house was it? Wow. <laughs> Memory. Probably a copy from my bomb hill, have you? I do indeed. I was just having myself a little sample of his honey. Not too heavy on the sweetness, just honey. Plain and simple and good enough to serve as a special tree on its own. This one definitely tasted different from the grueling grove honey. I'll make sure to memorize this flavor. Alright, here's the last of these errands. Could you bring me a combi from Ramanas Island? I must have that. What? How? How do I not have it? 47 with 60 to find. Experience candy large. Free more for another reward. I think I defeated it instead. Romanus Island is back in the Obsidian Fieldlands. I feel like I can't escape these two areas, you know what I mean? They're in the trees. Not a single shaky tree. So does that mean, like, I've just literally got to reload the zone? Oh, there's a shaking tree. Watch, you'll be a cherim now. Okay, it was a combi. Third time's the charm, then. The combi is an incredibly low level compared to what we're at. I will just chuck this. Combi, get in the ball, because simply put, <laughs> you see that star raptor that's above you? <laughs> that's what's coming for you next if you don't get in the ball. <laughs> Pretty much. Phew, did it. I mean, surely Combi's 10 already. Unless it just hit 10, that would be hilarious. I think I'd already caught enough Combi to get there. Right, so we got that one done. I mean, I guess I'll just have to dream of ever finding a Cherim at this point. <laughs> It is a dream never to be fulfilled by yours truly. Cherim is a legendary Pokemon in Pokemon Legends Arceus. 100%. I have finally got you a combi from Romanus Island. You really asked for the harder places you had to go and explore for. Let's have myself a little sample of his honey. This type of honey just begs to be stirred into a cup of tea. Must be something different about the flowers. So combi in different areas make different flavoured honey. What a delightfully mysterious bunch they are. Let's figure out how many different clusters of combi there are in the obsidian fieldlands alone. I'm getting the urge to go collect more honey. Thanks for helping me confirm my suspicions. I have some of my hand-selected dazzling honey. Job done. Free dazzling honey. Why, thank you, sir. We finally got one more request off the list. All right, I'm going to take one last stab 
at locating a Cherim on a march through the Crimson Mylands. Somehow, I don't reckon I will succeed. So we will probably split to an editing cut of me just being like, DISAPPOINTING! Let's give it one last shot. I just want to see one. Because then I can farm out the rest of the Pokedex entry off camera, right? Think about it. I got two shinies today. Pseudo Widow and Burmy. I just found an unknown. <laughs> Random unknown at the camp where misfortune were. Random unknown. Just hanging out. Bonk. Can't find a cherry. Can randomly walk into unknown. That brings it up to like four or five unknowns now. I can't find a shaking tree if I wanted to. Which I want to. They just don't exist. Of course there's an Alpha Paris blocking off my guy. Of course, why wouldn't there be? I must save Turtwig from the Alpha Paris. There we go. I can't find a Cherim. But I'll catch Turtwig. How about that? That was the best I could do. Because I can't even find a shaking tree. For the life of me. Right. So let's quickly just put the nose pass to guide the way one in. Because she's going to be somewhere in town, right? Where the hell's Gully gone? Oh, Gully's gone to the Cobalt Myelands? Yeah, Gunny's gone to the Cobalt Myelands, I think. Let's hand in this one. We've come back and we found your sister for the last time. It seems as if there's nothing you can't find. I'm always thanking you, but thanks again. There's simply no doubt in your abilities. I can't find a cherub, though. I know from wonder how you reassured her, telling you your teammates and all. She's even started calling you a savior. It really means a lot to her to be accepted by someone like you. And as a big brother, I appreciate you keeping her safe too, of course. I know that she can be a real scatterbrain, so I'm glad she's got you looking out for her. Nice request 69 complete. There we go. We want to end on a high. Not a low. Thanks again for helping me off that mountain, my trusty teammate, Olivandria. You know, I meant it. You'd be well suited to the security corps. Ever consider joining up? Nah. And then our other quest that we could turn in with the nose pass is actually back out in the Myelands. So let's get over there. Where do you think she is in this cave? Oh, I can actually use the Pokemon to go around here. There you are. Go get got. Did you find a nose pass for me? Why did you come in if you couldn't navigate the cave if you didn't have a nose pass? But you came in to begin with anyway. That sounds like a dumb idea. That's a nose pass, alright. Thanks for finding it. Now as I understand it, this Pokemon's giant nose always points to the same direction. So if it's facing this way, that means the exit must be over here. The nose pass never wanders indeed. I wish I'd encountered this Pokemon sooner. Are oh, you a big thanks? It's such a relief to finally have a nose pass as my trusty guide. Man, she's tapping her feet away though. All the twists and turns of a wayward cave can't stop me now. 68 is done as well. <gasps> a black Algorite! Well, now I can finish with something cool. Alpha Cleaver can be brought into the world. Alpha Cleaver. Let's do it. That quest actually gave me the black Algorite too. That I needed. Lush. Let's go get it. I might actually complete the nose pass Pokedex entry as well, or at least get it quite close. Let's go back to town and see how close that got me on the uh, 
I know he's past one. Get out of this snow. Yeah, rank 10. Once the people of Hisui discovered that its red nose always points north, they grew to rely on it greatly when traveling afar. The nose seems to work in a similar way to ancient compasses. When it's got a quest and you do that, it really clears it out. Nothing can clear out that nose, though. All right, then. Alpha Cleaver. Let's upgrade our one. To the biggest boy ever. First of all, we need the cleaver. We need the cipher. Where is Alpha Cipher? I'm gonna have to have fun upgrading those stats entirely. Then we need the Black Ogloid. Be funny if the Black Ogloid was needed to upgrade the uh, Quillfish as well. Probably is something like that. Give it to me. No space for that item right now. Yeah, that was the problem. That's why I got sent there. Give it to me. Alright. Big boy Alpha Cleaver is coming to the party. A... S A P. This is where it was a normal cleaver now. <laughs> Don't worry, we've got baby cleaver in. And big cleaver. There we go. An alpha to replace it. A big boy ready to go that we need to put on some extra levels, that's for sure, as we finish off another session of Pokemon. Properly this time. Legends Arceus. No Cherim, but Cleavers were got. Another Cleaver caught. Another Cleaver evolved. I will see you next time for more. Hopefully, we'll be able to find a Cherim then. I'll see you guys then. Bye-bye.